They are not your cookies. They are our cookies. They are my cookies. Would you have bought those cookies if he didn't request them? No. They're his cookies. Look, you can have as many of them as you want. I mean, y'all are married. What's done is done. But technically, and you know, perhaps in name only, they're his cookies. And that means I have the right to the last one. In a civilized relationship? Yeah. I'm just saying, I cannot believe you ate his last cookie without asking. He eats the last of everything all the time. No, I would never eat the last of your spinach or your soy milk or your veggie sausage. That's because you never eat any of them at all. Okay, but if I did like hallucinate I was a rabbit for a week, <laughs> I would ask you before I ate the last of any of that. Oh, and I confront her about it. And you know what she tells me? <sighs> Hit me. She tells me there's fruit salad in the fridge I can have instead. Fruit salad for dessert? Hey, two wrongs do not make a right. Look, I am sorry. Can you even imagine a situation where if you did ask me for my last cookie that I would say no? No, baby, I can't. That's because I love you more than life itself. I guess I just kind of want to be asked. Aww. Look at this little turd of events right here. Awfully fitting, considering it's Valentine's Day. Look, we all know Valentine's Day is not a real holiday. I don't know that. That's not a real holiday. You don't get the day off. That's more of like a responsibility that comes once a year. You know, like, like tax day. Wow, you're really sweet talking to me. Well, anyway, we, regardless of that, we still, from all of us here at Joe and Buzz, to all of you out there in YouTube land, want to tell you... Happy Valentine's Day. There you go. Hope all your Valentine's Day dreams come true. Just don't tell us about it or leave it in the comments or anything like that. Just keep it to yourself. Have a good one.